Hello, this quick guide is to show you how to use Unity Splines for animation. First step is to install Unity Splines. So let's go to our package manager. Here you see Unity registry and you can find here Splines. Here we go. And we can click install. Now we have our Splines installed. So there is another way for Unity 20 and 2021 to install Unity Splines. You should go to your package manager. So if you will go to Unity registry and search for Unity Splines, there will be no Splines available. So you should click this plus button and go to git URL and type a special URL com.unity.splines at now you see our splines are installing. So let's set a simple draw spline tool. I can stretch them a little bit to have some other form. Now you see I am creating this trajectory. I can move when I am editing spline as well. After I am ready with this plane, I can go back to my object mode. You can turn on and off visibility of your splines in Gizmos. It's very useful to lock our splines at the same point. Now our spline is ready, but I see there is a sharp corner. I can switch it to Bezier curve and this not become a Bezier curve. Now I have smoothed this angle with my tangents. So now it's ready. We should add a special component on our board. It's spline animate. It goes with Unity splines package. In this component, we should attach our spline container. Now we can animate our board. We can select different modes like time mode or speed mode. I will use speed mode. And now you see as I am increasing time, my bot is moving around. There are also other modes for loop animation and not loop animation. But for now we will have just a loop constant mode. As you can see, our bot is moving around. With Unity's client system, you can create different animations with different trajectories.